around here, are you? Hey YouTubers, it's Nuke again. Group C time for ya. Another TVT, which means a grumpy nuke. Four, three, two, one, zero. This is played on Medusa between Hwasen and Flash. Uh, I think both of these players are definitely players to watch for moving out of this group now because mm, the way that hwasen has been playing recently is just so amazing. But Hwasen is over here in purple. Hwasen is purple at the 3 o'clock position. And in blue, we have Flash. His command center is flashing, which is oh so appropriate. <laughs> that was stupid. Okay, these, this is Medusa. It's a three-player map. And I've seen a couple of long TVTs on this. <clears throat> Excuse me. A couple of long TVTs on this map. So I'm expecting another one from the file size I have here. And I've just been seeing so many long TVTs recently that I'm going to be so worn out by the time I get done with this match. I'm not sure if I'll be able to hit Group D tonight. I might. You never know. I'm going to be tired and raspy if it happens, but... Looks like Flash and... up. I was about to say up magic there. Looks like Flash and Hwasen are both putting down their supply depots right now. The Flash versus up magic game was spectacular. And I'm still referring to it in a lot of TVTs there. I re referred to it in the Fantasy vs. Lita match as well. So, yeah, it's just so good. I think I'm going to be referring back to it for a while now, for every new long TVT that comes out. That says Flash is epic with the sword. I guess he's a LARPer. Okay. Uh, yeah, whatever. Was that a pile of dung on that? Okay, never mind. Okay, very standard from both so far. It looks like neither is going to cheese the other here. No cheesy business, even though I'd say Medusa is one of my favorite maps to watch cheese on. Just because there's so many options for doing it. I remember mind putting down two barracks at the natural expansion, I think, of Midas. And that, that was hilarious. Midas never scouted it until it was too late. But both these guys are so good, I don't think anything like that's going to happen. Command center, fast command center from both. So we're looking at a strong macro game from both players here. Both are going 14 CC. 14 command center. Here comes the barracks out for Flash, and it looks like Wasson, I think, is going to put his barracks down as well. It's a very, very mirrored matchup here. Um, both have decided to go for an Econ build here. Um, no early pressure, nothing like that. Um, Wasson, I think, is probably my favorite to win this game, just because of how he's been dominating recently. He's beaten Flash recently. He has beaten Flash. He's shown that he can do it. And he's beaten Jadong, he's beaten Best, he's been stomping all over players and it's just, I think he has uh, really stepped up his game because he finally, he wants to finally get a championship here. Some players when they have that element of passion in their play, uh, there's just no stopping them. And I'm not sure if Flash has that same level and we'll see if he can bring his monster goodness to this game here. He's always been a monster Terran so I'm not sure if... He's going to show that here today or not. He certainly showed some good prowess in his versus up magic game, but up magic was just too crafty for him. Flash played much too standard and just didn't think ahead. So Flash is going to have to uh, think creatively in this game because Wasana is known for going for a lot of creative stuff. And he's gone for one wraith before to force Goliath out of mind, and uh, that's the only wraith he produced. And he just trampled mine because he had more tanks out on the ground. Um, mine, all he could do was get some glass out to deal with the wraith. He thought there was going to be more wraiths, but there wasn't. Okay, let's see what's going on. Flash is putting up his bunker. And it looks like two marines are going to go in and chat. They're going to have a bunker chat here today. Very self-referential, I know. And I think both are just committing to uh, two marines here. And it looks like Flash is going to get the scouts. And Flash <laughs> canceling his bunker. He was he stopped building it there for a second just so he could get the scout and figure out if he needed it. And he didn't. A uh, bunch of factories coming out for Flash instead. And I think 
that, um, yeah, I think that Hwasa might want to think about scouting that soon so he knows what's going on. Is the gas going down at Hwasa's natural expansion here? And Flash, since he canceled that bunker, he definitely has a strategy prepared. I think uh, <laughs> that was he was thinking of two branching strats from that, and this is his new strategy. Uh, getting a lot of factories out and going to try to put on some pressure to that natural expansion since he saw that uh, that Hwasan had gone for the 14cc as well. Hwasan is getting a lot more gas here, so I think he's going to, going to go heavy tanks. He's researching Siege as we speak. And Flash is not going for heavy tanks here. He's going what looks like a heavy vulture and uh, mixed with tanks army here. He's probably upgrading mines right now. And we'll see how this goes. It's always great to see branching strategies from Terrence in uh, TVT. Even though it always kind of ends up the same way, sort of. It's good to see uh, this kind of different strategies because it's fun to see which will work when. And it looks like Hwasan has scouted this with his barracks. He's going to try to head back here. He's got to run, run those Marines back to the base because the vultures are very, very fat. And speed upgrade. So I think Flash is going for his speed instead of mines. He might be going for mines soon as well. I'd say that is actually very likely. He's grouping his vultures in the middle, and he's probably upgrading mines so he can go in and cause a lot of damage to the front door. This is all vultures. And uh, I think Watson's going to have trouble defending this. He's got to bring in all of those tanks at the front. And Flash is getting his mines out here. He's Once those mines complete, I think he's going to try to do some very aggressive play here. Watson is uh, trying to push Flash a little bit further away from that natural, I think. Uh, armory out for uh, Watson, so I think he's going to start going for Goliath here. I don't know if he knows about the starport going up or not. He could have uh, scanned that starport coming out for Flash. Maybe that's why he put down the armory. Or it could be just be for upgrades. You never know. So, okay, mines all over the place for Flash. Now he's going to keep Hwasen from, <laughs> oh, from moving out. And he's getting a control tower, so I think he is going for some drops soon. Hwasen going out with a single Marine trying to draw some um, mines away there. <laughs> Mind clearing Marine. That Marine had a short, painful life. Doing it for the Terrans, man. Doing it for the Terrans. Okay, the let's see. Th finally, the tanks are coming out for Flash. So Flash is going to try to put on some sieging pressure. And it looks like Glass are actually out here. So instead of going for a lot of vultures, it looks like Hwasan is trying to counter this kind of army with Goliaths. And Flash was going to try to get a Goliath, not a Goliath, but a Vulture run by there, and it didn't quite work out for him. Here comes a dropship from Flash. So he's going to get a bunch of dropships out. Usually you'll usually see about five or six dropships out. Um, depends on what <laughs> time in the game you are in, of course. Here comes that dropship. So he might be thinking about dropping some Vultures right on top of the tanks, trying to draw some siege fire. And both are going to try to take the middle now. This is going to be very important. Whoever takes the middle here could end up winning the game. Because the middle is just so large, it's very hard to take it. But once you have it, uh, as <laughs> has been proven in the Hwasan versus uh, Mind game, uh, you if you can keep that middle, you're going to win. Because you can take the map maneuverability and starve your opponent out. Ooh, it looks like a vulture drop here. That's what uh, Flash was going for here. He's dropping vultures and he's putting mines all over the place here. And he's going to try to get some excellent economic harassment done here. And it looks like Wasson has a ton of STVs here at his main. He might have run them from another expansion or something. I'm not sure. Or maybe he's just building them up so he can expand soon. But Flash is just picking at these STVs. Okay, uh, it looks like Hwasan has scanned and gotten rid of a lot of those mines. So he's finally going to clean this up. Not a heavy, heavy loss. Not as big of a loss as I thought it was going to be, definitely. <laughs> this is one. Vulture survives. Go, Vulture. Live on. And it looks like Flash is going to use it to scout. He's going to see all of the buildings from Hwasan. Hwasan <laughs> almost killed that Vulture with a single SCV. Finally, the tank comes in to mop it up. And Wasson, he has his barracks there in the middle. 
as well as Flash has his, but Hwasen's is under huge in huge trouble because it's uh, on fire here and he can't repair it, but looks like whole oh, Flash is moving in with a huge tank army. I'm not sure where he pulled all these tanks from, but he's coming in with a huge tank army. I think he's going to be able to take the middle right now. 